Hello and welcome and in today's uh, video let's understand the job opportunities for 2020 for AWS jobs especially in India and I'll also let you know about the AWS re or restart or start program. So the agenda for today's discussion would be AWS education programs, AWS job scenarios 2022. It is just a sequel of the previous AWS uh, short summary video. If you have not seen please go ahead and see the links are provided and role-based requirements which are required for AWS, right? Okay, so what are the job scenarios for AWS? Now the first one is AWS Solution Architect. So let's go and see how many jobs are available and is there a scope? Go to Glassdoor, it requires your sign-in. So just type there AWS Solution Architect and you will find various jobs in India. You hit the search and uh, these are the jobs which you would find all right what you'll do average salary around six lakh what do they really need so this description is a little vague because they always ask you to be a bridge between the client and the aws services that means you need to be well versed with aws technology you should know the agile development development process you should know the architecture how to build how to deploy models on cloud and how to carry on their entire uh, you know uh, ecosystem onto the cloud how to take it forward from there that is what they will expect from you and so because of that they want that you should have at least one or two years of experience you can see HP here they are also having some job for the AWS solution architect and uh, okay customer challenges what are the technical skills which are required here as you can see experience with migrating solutions all right qualification see minimum three or four years in consulting architecture design deployment or something like that they are not necessarily wanting you to be having this experience in aws but you should know something about architecture and design provided you understand the basics of aws and the cloud and how do you really work on it that is sufficient and this is a good company all right 10 years of experience and you should have an experience of four or five solution in terms of design architecture and implementing so that yes you can really prove yourself so if you have that experience then this is a good company to work with all right solution architect in this is this is the company i like your solution architect aws enterprise and I would show you it is asking for seven years experience as a solution architect or related role. All right. So the basic requirement for all these things, AWS, that means you're working on cloud or any of the cloud technologies, be it on Google or Azure. But the thing is that you should know how the system of architecture works. The only difference is of the terminologies when you're using different cloud services. So you know this is uh, again amazon service and you will be doing a lot of thing here building relationship to understand the customers partners and you should know the in and out of the architecture that you will be working with and the average salary as you can see it's five lakhs to six lakhs that's their extending that means five to six lakhs thirty five thousand to forty three or forty eight thousand in hand maybe yeah okay so this was about the solution architect but the main drawback is that if you are a beginner I mean even I wouldn't get a job in AWS because I don't have this experience not the knowledge of it so if you're if you are like I get queries who are having five years of experience or ten years of experience in networking or security or have done some related or into DevOps or something then go ahead with a certification of DevOps AWS DevOps and apply for these companies they will be happy to have you because you already have experience and also you know how does things work on cloud right so don't don't just hesitate on you know going forward and applying for these jobs get knowledge of aws do some course some training and apply for this if you have got good experience seriously i'm telling you this is rewarding and over the period of time you can really increase your pay this is lucrative it is in demand and of course you can go always go into academia you can always teach 
that's always always worth giving a try okay so this was about solution architect you can also type here for ml engineers solution architect associate okay drupal <laughs> so this is they are having you to have two or four years of relevant experience in developing and leading modules tracks and drupal projects for enterprise clients and blah blah i don't understand what is this but 18 paid holidays okay so you can just go ahead and see if you are really looking for an associate of solution architect so this is about the Glassdoor. Go and search and roll search. You get some authentic companies here. Another site that I searched was Google and um, Nokia.com. So I searched AWS Cloud and it gave me like um, application architect, AWS Cloud migration. This is from IBM. Six to 10 years of experience. Senior Cloud Engineer, AWS Terraform Data Lake. 5 to 9 years of experience, Cape Gemini, 15 to 20 years. God, I'll go old, you know. <laughs> System Cloud Engineer, AWS Cloud Engineer, 528, 528, 528, 528, Ratsack, AWS Cloud Admin, and so on. Now, this is like 2 to 4 years, okay. Little less uh, is required. So, you can always, even if you're a fresher, do apply on these, even if they're asking for 1 or 2 years of experience you might get you lucky you might get lucky just have confidence and in, uh, in what you have learned and what training you've underwent of course you should have these knowledge about aws cloud computing of infrastructure services and so on and uh, the the company were asking for one or two years experience and if you have gone the aws cloud training or aws any of the certification course don't hesitate to apply on these forms because already your domain experience plus your theory knowledge of aws can really help you because they would be providing you some sort of training when they induct you okay so this was about glassdoor and nokri and how do you and the various aws solution architect uh, uh, job profiles of aws in aws cloud in india only right okay so there there are jobs i would say there are so many jobs required but we do not have that skill so people upgrade yourself and join this team of aws and for this was for 2022 i mean this is the year is just ending 2022 is just starting so it's a good time to upgrade your skill and get a good job handsome pay and what else yeah all right AWS education programs now this is something really fascinating about AWS that they understand the need and they come up came up with the AWS restart re or start if you want to uh, you know as a launching pad to your career if you're a beginner and you want to make your journey into AWS then uh, you get free training and you, uh, provided that you are not employed you're not working anywhere you want to restart your career and you're also available for the training from Monday to Friday, 12 weeks from morning till the evening. So the whole day, entire day training of AWS will be provided to you free of cost. And uh, this has a potential that it will launch you in full time job after course completion. So if you're really interested, do search out this thing of AWS uh, re or start program. So. Uh, we are in Asia Pacific, go to India, you will see the affiliated organizations here and they, these are the organizations which are providing you the training. So I have opened a few here, I mean all. So let's, let's just uh, see a few of them. Alright, so this is, uh, this one I have gone through. This is Roman and what they are asking is that um, the cost of two eligible learner is free again the batches are full registration close for the next batch and open for next batches in january 2022 onwards so this is a good time because registration are open and if you are sitting at home not doing anything this is the right time to go ahead and register for this and take training for three weeks typically i mean sorry 12 weeks not three weeks sorry 
12 weeks, Monday to Friday, 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. rigorous training, and this will land you to in a job. So they are making you skills sitting at home. And uh, further details, if you are really interested, do enroll and find out more about this program. The next is again, this is again an affiliated, uh, I would say, organization with AWS, which is providing you free training, and the locations are here, as you can see. They will provide you offline training in these locations and uh, what's in for you you'll get certificate and all these things so you can also register for the program over here and this is again a 12-week program same standard class set now this is again a different organization see if you are unable to get access to one you can try the others right so this is again another one apply now all right Class begin, graduation, advance your career, and so on and so forth. This is again another, and this is again another. Jobs Academy, restart the program. One I, I came across that was asking some 2,000 rupees. This was, yeah. Edu Bridge was asking for 2,000 rupees registration. But other, other organizations are not. So I would suggest that the ones which are totally free, go ahead with that. These are registration charges. Maybe... It might be hidden in these because I have not gone through the registration process myself. This you have to go through this process. I can just tell you that this is this is a great opportunity for you to learn free of cost and also uh, upgrade your skills this January, this new year. Okay, and this one is the Jobs Academy. Again, this is also providing you the same thing. All right, different organizations providing you the training. Okay, I come back to the AWS main site and I go to education program wherein there's also called Academy, AWS Academy. Here, one important thing that I came across was that AWS announces the AWS AI and ML scholarship program. So this is an add-on news which I came across and this is new that um, actually they are giving scholarship to many people and you can enroll in that scholarship and if you win, you get a course free from Simply Learn, I guess, which is $4,000 worth price. Sorry, Udacity. Udacity AI program, nano degree, you would get, which is $4,000 USD value, you would get scholarship in that. And if you figure in the top 500, you would earn the second level, second advanced Udacity nano degree, uh, curated specifically for AWS AI and ML scholarship recipients. So that means you've got more chances of recruitment in specifically for AWS, ANI, AL, AI and ML, this thing. And this is a six month course, combines deep learning and ML engineering, nano degree concepts to prepare students for technical careers. And then you can go forth and apply for different things. So just uh, try and, uh, you know, again, I would say just go ahead and try in the scholarship, participate, you will get tons of free resources to work with, to learn from. Um, it's not necessary that you would get the scholarship, but what is necessary that you attempt, at least get an idea and exposure of it. Okay. Okay, uh, coming back, coming back. One more thing about education program is, okay, we are in this academy. So, right. So these are, this is like something where you will get educators, institute, institutions, students and employers. And they are under one roof okay and you can read about the curriculum you can go ahead with the courses that they have learners lab data analytics if you are interested in and go to the course foundations academy this is the academy wherein you can really learn and pay right okay so but something is something they are giving you for free but provided you are not working this is only for those who are at some some kind of, uh, you know, want to restart, not having any um, resources to fulfill their needs. So they can go ahead with this. Of course, there are certain requirements that you need to fulfill. So I hope that this was useful. Go ahead and keep checking this time because I, I keep a record of AWS, what's new they are offering and so good to share things with you. And this was it for this video. And... If you have not watched the first one, then please go ahead and watch it because this is the latest upgraded AWS news, which 
was requested and has been here now. Thank you for watching.